rightful home. The speed of the Allied advance brings towns into and out of the news before the sound of sniping has died down. Before the war, Gottesberg was a world-famous German spa. It looks like being a long time before anyone wants to spend a holiday here again. Hell yes. White flags flying from houses speak louder than words about the state of mind of German civilians. Nazi appeals to fight it to the last cannot convince them that there is any hope. Allied might passing through their towns tells them the truth in more direct terms. The people of Gottesburg get their instructions. This is probably the first non-Nazi news board they have seen for 12 years. And some of them don't like it. One of Gottesburg's historic spots is the Rhine Hotel Dresden. Here, Mr. Neville Chamberlain visited Hitler in 1938. German prisoners defeated by Allied armies on German soil are a reminder that much has happened between then and now. For some prisoners, the Allied coming is a gala day, but they're not Germans. These are press-ganged Frenchmen, Poles, Russians, Serbs, freed in Germany. Across the square are Germans taken prisoner in their own country. Expressions are a good guide to who's who among the nationalities. The Germans taken prisoner on the soil of the fatherland have less to be happy about. The cameraman with an eye for types signed off on three of Hitler's handsome Nordic musketeers, Bathos, Pathos and Amorous. 